All of us in this room have a bunch of things we need to work on. Just like this. Here, here, back. Good, what is the one thing that I need to do right now that will start to help me with the other things? You know, at QB Summit, what we're trying to do is we're just trying to help quarterbacks take a step. And we do that by simplifying the game. Ryan, your one thing. Hands apart, hands apart, hands apart. If you're competing to be the starter for the first time in high school on the JV team, on varsity, if you're um, trying to make it into be one of the top quarterbacks in the country in Elite 11 or all these different camps, or you're, you're already committed somewhere and you're just trying to get ready for college, what we try and do is help quarterbacks take a step. Just get my left arm off, and if I know I get that off. Love it, let's try it. You know, I believe things like there's only three throws in football. We drive, we layer, we throw a touch. I just think that most high school guys don't have the right definition, they have a different definition than me, of what touch is. When we throw a touch ball, we gotta do two things. I wanna start it off with the right trajectory, and I wanna finish it, okay? I wanna turn it up and over and get it to come down. Being a quarterback in the classroom. Now we're here, we're on platform, triple threat position. I wanna get three pumps in the throw. As soon as you know it really well, you're automatically, you shift to helping the people around you. We only play the game two ways. We're either on platform or we're moving around off platform. So I'm here, two, three, and I want that fourth rep to look and feel exactly the same, okay? Just a heads up, next time you see a coach grabbing something and cleaning it up, it's a race to help him. Don't go through this as fast as you can. Go through it. As fast as you can do perfect. As fast as you can do perfect. Here we go. The top, top defensive coordinators and coaches are Serious, serious chess expert. You really are in a chess match when you're playing football. As a quarterback, like why I'm really excited to be here is because you're really more like the chess player out there. Throw the middle, send the king, get out the pieces, right? Where am I vulnerable? If I'm not vulnerable, where can I attack? In order to get better, you have to lose a lot. You never forget losing, and that's kind of the best way to get better. I would venture to say that if Jordan had still been coaching Jordan, he might still be playing. He's given us pointers and insight into what it takes to become a college or professional athlete. I really talk about journey a lot here at QB Summit because every quarterback's on one and how you deal with success and adversity is essentially how good you're going to be. This is our first camp experience and it's been fantastic. I think what Jordan does is actually pretty impressive. If you look at opportunities where you can be strategic and be a leader and build character, there's a lot of different ways that you can do that, not just through the sport of doing drills in football. It's kind of like the Montessori of football. 